Hello and welcome to Indus News coming to you live from our studios in Lahore. I am Jabhat Tehami and these are the headlines. We begin in Iran, where President Hassan Rouhani has threatened to resume uranium enrichment in 2015 nuclear deals. Pledges are not fulfilled. Rouhani set a 60-day deadline to the world powers to implement their promises to protect Iran's oil and banking sectors from the U.S. sanctions. Next, at least 42 Afghan soldiers and insurgents have been killed in renewed clashes across Afghanistan. In western Farah province, 15 government soldiers and Taliban fighters were killed during clashes. Taliban said that 25 other Afghan soldiers were killed in attacks in Kandhar, Helmand, Lagman and Pakhtia provinces. In Pakistan, at least nine people have been killed in a blast targeting a police vehicle near a shrine in the eastern city of Lahore. Officials said two others were injured in the blast outside the Data Darbar shrine. In another development, Sudan's Transitional Military Council has agreed with protesters on the general structure of the rule. The army rulers said Islamic law should remain as the guiding principle in the new civilian government. Protesters gave their proposals for a civilian government to the military council last week.